followers and welcome to Fashion Sewing Blog TV. I'm Colleen G. Lee and in this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to insert a godet. If you are looking to add fullness to a particular area of your garment, for example a hemline on a skirt or dress, one of the best technique is to use an insertion of fabric. This is a godet and it's triangular in shape, doesn't necessarily have to be triangular, it could also be put into the slash or even a dart area and that gives you the extra flounce or flare that you will need in the area that you require it and that is what I'm going to show you. I have my seam pressed and open, so I've pressed it and opened it and it stops where I want the go day to be inserted. So once I've got that in position the next thing is to get my godet, triangular in shape, and you can see a tailor's tax here. And I'm going to position that to where the seam has actually ended. So I'm going to put that into position. Actually, I'll just lift up one side. It's going to be right in the centre of the seam line and place a pin. And then, once I'm happy with that, I'm going to line the edge of the godet to the edge of the seam and place pins. And then I'm going to do the same on the other side. Here it is pinned into place. You can base if you wish. We just need to make sure that this point here of the godet is what is not going to be sewn. So you're going to start where that dot is and then sew down on each side of the godet. I'm starting with my needle down in the little marker that I've made and I'm not going to back stitch but I am going to back stitch when I come to the end. Pull my pins out as I go. It's quite easy insertion to do. It's just remembering to start in the for your tail attack and not to reverse is a secret I would say. And then a back tack and then I do the same on the other side. I'm now doing either side and the go day is flat on the machine and I'm going to start where the seam line is actually finished. So I'm going to put my needle into that position. Yes, happy with that. I'm not going to back tack, just going to sew straight down to the end. And when I come to the end, I'll just reverse and secure my stitching. This is how the go day looks on the wrong side. As you can see, we've got a nice finish to the top of the go day. And I'll turn it on to the right side. And there we have a beautifully inserted go day. Go days are a great way of adding fullness to a hemline of a skirt or a dress or even creating like a flouncy kind of feel to the garment. So if you are looking for a solution to adding more fullness, give go days a try. Don't forget to subscribe to Fashion Zone Blog TV for free weekly video tutorials and if you have any comments or queries, please put them in the comment box below and I'll see you next time.